Alright, hey everyone, this is Jacob, and well, I am finally here with another video other than Minecraft, and well, I'm playing probably my favorite game, Assassin's Creed 4, or at the moment, my favorite game, Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. Um, as you can see, I've already played this twice, here's mine 78%, and then 29%, and start new game. Let's just call this one, um, uh, let's see, let's play confirm now of course i already have played this um because the first time that i tried to record it basically messed up and i had my fraps on 30 fps and guess what 30 fps can't handle this game can it so i set it up and now voila i can do this Stand right here, not fall. Okay, so... Oh! Oh, really? I did not know that. Firing cannons, I'm pretty sure I know how to play this game. Played it yesterday, and also the day before that. Now nah, these cannons are good. Probably takes like 20 minutes to kill like one ship. Oh, this is terrible shit. <laughs> oh. oh my god, I missed. How did I miss? Okay, do I just sink all of them? I don't know, I haven't played this part in a while. Come on. There we go. Okay. Now we go after the big boy here. What kind of ship is that? I oh, can't even use the telescope yet, can you? I'm pretty sure I didn't press space. That is one weak ship. That's great. Okay. And let's then let's just ram him for the final kill. Really? That doesn't even do much. Oh yeah. I guess our ram probably isn't that up there. Okay, there we go. And I guess the guy got off that ship and was just like, oh my god. Oh shit. Oh wow, everyone. Backstabbed. I'm pretty sure you would have died from that, <sighs> but okay. Video games are awesome. Can't die dangerous? from that. Edward. Hmm? Privateering. Is it dangerous? Wouldn't pay so nice if it weren't. Well, why not sail with the king's navy? Earn a proper wage. Sail under gentlemen. Sod the navy's gentlemen. For every shilling I'd earn, the captain gets six hundred. That's no way to earn a fortune. We don't need a fortune. It's not about need, Caroline. I want food that don't make me sick. I want walls that hold back the wind. I want a decent life. H how long would you be gone with these privateers? A year, I reckon. Two at the most. All right. No more than two. Promise me. I'm guessing that that is not gonna hold. Oh no, I'm drowning. <gasps> oh, look at that. I'm swimming. And I have no one help. I can't even pull out my fists. Come on. I don't even have fists. I only have swords. Well, this is realistic. Let's see. 
Oh, I can't even dive under. Oh no. He doesn't know how to go underwater yet. He doesn't know how to use his fists either. Let's go over here in the rain. Can it stop raining? Thank you. Ah, uh, stopped. Ooh, perfect. <laughs> oh, do you like seagulls? I like seagulls. Gonna watch seagulls too. Okay. Seagull party. <laughs> Was it good for you as well? Havana. I must get to Havana. Well, I'll just build us another ship, will I? I can pay you. Isn't that the sound you pirates like best? One hundred Eskimos. Keep talking. Will you or won't you? You don't have that gold on you now, do you? To you, I had never even heard of Sneaksby until this game came out, so... Aha, now I can use my fist. He knows that he's his fist. He learned well. Come on, mate. We're off to a bad start. Do I have any treasure maps with me by chance? I do. At least the treasure maps from my previous game. Throw money! Oh wait, I don't have any. Haha. -ha. Okay. Let's... It's a hundred okay. leagues or more to Havana. Will you walk that distance? Oh, and by the way, guys, I'm just going to tell you something. I'm the kind of person that's going to stop during a mission, like during a chase, just to synchronize on a viewpoint. I'm just going to tell you that right now. Um, and like I said before, yes, I have played this. You saw my other save files. I've beaten the game already. And, yeah. But pirates are probably one of my... I don't know. I love pirates. Anything to do with them. Perfect. Um, so, yeah. And I should probably turn my Steam thing off. That'd probably be a good idea. I'll do that next episode. Don't have time to do it now. Because you probably be getting a lot of updates. Just can let you know. Hey there. Oh, where is that oh, chest kid. at? Where's he running to? I want that chest. I kinda do want that chest. Oh. And I'll kill you. Okay, fine. Jeez, sorry. I don't want to mess up the swag. Yeah. Oh, nah, it's now not a good time. Ooh, hi. See, is there like a chest around? Oh, there's the chest. Okay. I kinda want some money when I go to Herberana. Pretty sure that message just already said it. Itself, but whatever. Crap. We could work together on this. Yeah, now recording is like perfect because it's not so laggy. How do you make an eagle sound when you jump? Like seriously, what the heck? It's not how that works, but I didn't make an eagle sound. Oh, maybe I have to jump from there. Keep your distance! Why are you suck at shooting? <laughs> you must have like shot like right next to me. And then now you shot me, but I'm I'm just that good. Dang it. Why do assassins have to be like this? Like, why can't we all just be Templars? This would make life's not at nearly as simple. That wasn't even that hard. All the other times, they're being easy. Okay, I'll shut up now. Senor Duncan Walpole, I accept your most generous offer and 
await your arrival with eagerness. If you truly possess the information we desire, we have the means to reward you handsomely. Though I will not know your face by sight, I believe I can recognize the costume made infamous by your secret order. Therefore, come to Havana in haste, and trust that you shall be welcomed as a brother. Sumas humilde servidor, el gobernador Laureano Torres y Ayala. Mr. Walpole, let's collect your reward. It's kind of weird to just throw away some hidden blades. But whatever. That school will do me just fine. Oh, let's go take it. Oh, whoops, I forgot to sing. Yeah. To repay for it, let's go grab the chest inside of the waterfall. Stockings are ones. They can be used for stocking people. Our destination is Havana. I'm just a merchant. Quiet, you bleeding pirate! You'll hang for the mess you made out there! Sir, I had nothing to do with this attack. My crew and I have merely anchored to water and resupply. No, Mr. Merchant. I will save you! Ah. After him! Ah, Mr. Merchant. Hi. How are you today? That's not very kind, but I wouldn't need to stop that, thank you. Are you gonna attack me first? Thank you. Now... I don't care if you pay me, I want to search this body first. Cause I don't know if I'm going to be able to later. Thank you. Don't know where that is, I don't even care where that is. That's here. Oh god. Oh god! I know that's here, because I've tried this one before. Okay, so there's an X right there, so you have to go past the broken ship and into that. It's gotta be like over here. Then. Take my sugar. Take anything you I don't want your sugar. I think this is it, maybe. I know it's on the side. It's got to be over here, because what else could be here? There it is. Sweet. That is fancy. Alright. Perfect. How long is he going to be screaming? I mean, I've already gone. He could have ran by now. Yes! Okay, now I have... Whoa! Oh, well, how come I can't have a sugar? Because you can sell that for a lot, I'm pretty sure. Just kidding, I already know this stuff. I'm trying to play along. Oh, no, I'll pay you. Why are you laying on Anything the ground? Get up. Like. Get up. By God's grace, sir. You saved me. A profusion of thanks. What are you doing? It is my vessel, yes. But uh, here lies its poor captain. And I have no art for sailing. I can pilot her myself, no mind. You don't mean to abscond with my ship, do you? I'm Duncan. What's your name, friend? Steed, Steed Bonnet. Well, Mr. Bonnet, let this stay twixt us. But I'm on a secret errand for His Majesty the King, God save him, and I must get to Havana with speed. Ah, oh, that is a relief, sir. Havana is also my destination. Our ways lie together. Natural allies, then. Ah, you put me at ease, sir. To think I took you for a pirate when you first appeared. Did you? Yes. You have an uh, uncommon way of handling yourself. Quick and easy, if I may say. Gave me quite a fright. But, all things considered, I think it's turned out to be a rather fortuitous day, hasn't it? Okay. Uh, yeah, sometimes, but my eyes, or the eyes in this, they do turn, like, neon or whatever, so. 
from underwater swim. Okay. And since that is Steve Bonnet for all of you that do not are not familiar with Steve Bonnet in real life. Um this will turn out to be the vessel called the Revenge. Not the Queen Anne's Revenge, but just the Revenge. Steve Bonnet ship, which I'm Steve Bonnet was again to this part. So Welcome aboard, Duncan. She's a modest schooner, but oh, well she doesn't have any cannons. trafficking cargo from my plantation and such. She'll do fine. There's a strong wind now. Let's strike to full, shall we? Close up! Keep her steps! Okay. Let's see. Ah, there's a tug of the wind at my hair. Ah, I find a bracing comfort in the feel and smell of the ocean. The raw stink of... Boom. Of possibility. That's a top way of seeing it, mate. Probably should set a timer on really this. So while I'm sailing, since it's pretty easy for me, I am gonna set a small timer. Those sailors were quite animated by the idea of pirates roaming these waters. Is it a real danger? Do you suppose? A possibility. But most pirates stop. Okay, there we go. Got my timer set. Oh, I see. Yes. That is a bustling straight. Okay, there we go. Now I can can do stuff. But I shouldn't okay. worry about being waylaid by pirates, truth be told. My oh. ship is small, and I have nothing of immense value. Sugarcane and its yields, molasses, rum, that sort of thing. Oh, what? How's that nice There's part? not a pirate living who turn his back on a keg of rum. Well, yes. Yes, I suppose that's true. My point. There we go. Okay. And now we're in the ocean. Grab a duck on the wind. All right, let's let's check this out. Come back. All right. Let's see, and there we go. You're a natural sailor, Duncan. I did a decent trick at the helm some time ago. Two years before the mast as a privateer. Dash my buttons. Your life seems a grand one, if I may say. So full of adventure. How marvelous. I've seen my share of strangeness, I. Very promising. Well, that's obviously in the past. Let's just run around this room for like ten minutes. I can dance. All right. Dang it, no, Easy I can't now. dance. There you go. Welcome back. You interrupted my dance session. That's my dance session. Well, oh, yeah, you're not my dance session. Okay, guess I'm gonna get my well, dance session. Sure I'm sorry. Break your brain, all right? How, how would my brain be I need baked? you to move your head and look it's at these like lights. I was here. in the oven. Or look up. I? I think I was. Wait, well, what's going on? Well, wow. That's it. Turned off. Down. Oh, I turned off too. Or, no, wait. So no, far there. so good. Oh, crap. Let's get you up. Wait, how do I get up? Oh, so, I'm alive. Welcome to the Sample 17 project. What's that? Before you get started, you're going to need this. Is that like a... There you go. A bomb in my ear, probably. Testing, testing, one, two, three. Hello, bonjour. C'est bon? It works? I don't speak French. All right, let's take a walk. Okay. The file says you've done some memory research before, but not to this extent, I'll play which is surprising. Cream. You're very Clucker. good. The data streams are very stable. No, I'm good. All right. Oh, oh, hi, how are you doing? I just... I'm spying on you over there. Okay, let's go. Impressive, right? This building is barely six months old, but Abstergo Entertainment has been a studio for a few years, Maybe. since 2010. Very interesting. I'm guessing that is from, I don't even know. Guessing. Maybe you saw Liberation? 
Nope. That was our first title. Actually, I haven't played Liberation. Tech. That's that was just the didn't. tip of the iceberg. Soon, we'll be unveiling commercial Animus servers for the whole world to enjoy. They'll offer passive experiences, of course. Edited versions of real history. But only the exciting parts. And we think we found the perfect subject for our first full-length virtual feature. Caribbean Pirates. So that's it's your Caribbean, game. actually, not Caribbean. It'll just take a minute, okay? Okay. And then there's Rebecca from Assassin's Creed 3. Count. Well, thank you, Nancy. Bon journée. C'est bon, c'était prêt. Magnifique, merci. I still don't speak French. This is for you. The primary tool of our trade. Your communicator. Who? Power it up and give it a look. It's pretty slick. It's free. Uh, how? Now I can track you. You might have noticed that security seems a little light around here. That's because your communicator is your key to getting around. Well, security's not just for getting around. What are you looking at? Okay, I'm gonna go back. I guess this doesn't... I guess this means that we can't press every button on the elevator. See that flashing elevator. wireless signal? Not anymore. It means you're hooked up to the elevator. I'll let you okay. do the honors. We're headed up to the Sample 17 studio, second floor. Now we can go. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, it's going up, it's going up, oh my god. I'm scared is it's gonna fall on me? No, it's not, okay, good. You ready? Are Let's you go. not scared or something? What the heck? Ah, there's the boss, Olivier Garneau, our CCO. I'll introduce you. Bonjour. Salut, Mélanie. Ça va bien? Well, thanks. Have you met our new hire? Just started today. I haven't. Bonjour. What project? Sample 17, the Kenway line. Hey them, Connor. Edward, the pirate. Ah, yar, yar, maybe. It's not what I was thinking, but okay. <laughs> Sounds good. Welcome aboard. Uh, Milani, can we talk in your office for a minute? Nope. Just let me get this one settled and I'll see you in five minutes. Ah, I said nice no, actually. You. Not yes, but okay. So? This is the Sample 17 floor. We're diving into the memories of one very generous donor, Desmond Miles. We're pulling all the best stuff from his DNA. By and the hopefully way, he's one day dead. we can forge some fantastic experiences from what we find in there. Oh, look at that, it's me. It's me, you guys, look at that, it's me. Just kidding, I'm... There's no mirrors around here because something has a reflection. This pair of legs is John, one of the wizards in IT. He's just fixing something for you. Not fixing, calibrating. Calibrating, right. So here we are. Your very own Animus workstation. He's calibrating his This legs. is all yours. So sit back, relax, and find us some good footage. If you need any hints Wait, or tips, the Animus is loaded with tutorial programs, so you'll have no problems. What if the chair breaks? And I'll check in on you later. Happy pirating. Oh, I will. Okay. Thank you for leaving me alone. Okay. Welcome to Animus Omega. You're welcome. Abstergo oh. Entertainment's proprietary ancestral memory research tool. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns about how to operate your Animus console, please contact your project supervisor, Melanie LeMay. You have been registered as part of the Sample 17 project. Your primary research target is Edward James Kenway, born March 10, 1693, Swansea, Wales. Calibrations complete. All signs normal. All systems optimal. Extra neural transmitters activated. Oh, look at that. I'm in Havana. Havana. I'm pretty sure this is Havana. Okay. And instead of setting a timer, I'm gonna do a sequence. I'm gonna do a sequence each time. So cancel timer. That counts as a sequence, but let's do something else. I don't wanna make this just this short, so. Ah, uh, <laughs> lively Havana. I've been here once before. It was a truly awful pleasure. See someone you know? No, 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 just putting on a friendly face. I shouldn't want to be mistaken for a pirate again. Right. Flash rogue like yourself must be cautious. Yeah. 
pirates beware. Why don't I finish up this mission, not the secret of the mission? And then we can crowd an episode. Mad to think Spain and England were right at war two years ago, isn't it? Here I am, bartering with Spaniards like they were my cousins. Nothing wrong, Duncan? No, it's nothing. Sand in my hampers. So where's the best squad in town? I'm dying for a quick kip. Or a siesta, should I say. Um, I'm just headed to uh, a public house now to meet some merchants. I could, I could show you the way. Well, lead on. Let's put my hood on and make me look way more suspicious. I hope you'll tarry a bit while I conduct my meeting. It'd be a great relief to have a man of your stature nearby in case of a misunderstanding. I can hang about. I might have a drink. Spend it. <laughs> drink. <laughs> he doesn't but do they don't take kindly drinks. to pirates here, do they? Wonder how many stolen reals bought these men this perch. Hola, ladies. I don't know these women, do you? Oh. No. They charge money for that kind of privilege. A few dozen reals for every hour of knowing. Keen to meet them? No. Goodness, no. I'm a, I'm a married man. A married man of their forte, mate. Bam, 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 bam. Uh oh, sorry. I'm having fun opening up the Havana thing. Aha! Here's a purveyor of personal defenses. I should acquire a blade for myself, don't you? Just as you have. This rusty raise is nothing to admire. Oh, it is. So, I appear a mere kitten walking so close upon you. Perhaps a small dagger would suit me. Let's see what he's selling. Pew. Maybe I'll buy a sword too. We'll both jump rank. Oh, we'll be quite the pair, you and I. Twin devils. I don't Lend us a few reals again. then. I did save your skin. Ah, uh, of course. Cheers. How many reals did he give me? Okay, sweet. Uh, I'm pretty sure I should be able to buy these right here. Like, he just gave me enough money to buy those. What? How come I can't get okay, I wanna, wanna buy something. How do you fare? There we go. I can't even buy pistol sets yet. Okay, well, I would like to buy... Great, now I can't buy those yet. Okay. No, oh, no, I can't buy those. The uh, ammunition, smoke bombs. No, I don't need smoke bombs. Alright. Yeah, I don't need a small knife, sadly. Still, it'll do in a pinch. Oh, puffer duff. Puffer duff? What? What's going oh, on no there? Matter. I'll get us a better view. What are we looking for? Uh, a tavern. A sort of courtyard interior. My goodness, you're an agile chap. Every finger's a fish hook. That's how you tell a true sailor. <laughs> right. A fine way to put it. Let's see. I'm gonna totally fool the game here and just synchronize backwards. Synchronize. The circle looks interesting. I can see a lot from here. I think I see the place. Ah, what, how, what? We're not far. Hang tight. He called him a fat man. No. Not my fat man. Not my fat man. Stop back or I'll here. break your knees when I catch you. I'll break his knee. Don't worry. Oh wait, I am him. Crap. I'm coming for you. Oh god. Oh, I went the wrong way. What kind of insult is that? Da 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 da. I did it. I did it. Here I come. You robbed the wrong man, mate. I'm pretty sure he's not dead because he's kind of moving. Now he's dead. As are they. I like how right when I kill him, guards magically appear somewhere. And then he played his drive signal. Hero bears. Uh, do you guys have any guns? Because I kind of need a couple bucks here. Alright, might as well take all these guys some money because it's the beginning of the game. So, a couple extra bucks. It'll be nice to have. 
it's right when I kill him, not when I knock him out, but when I kill, not when I t like take all of his money, but right when I kill him, guards just magically appear and they're like, nope, that's not right. But knocking him out and taking his money, perfectly fine. Wonderful cards. Oops, not the right call for that. Hey, yeah, I'm over here. There we go. No. Okay. Oh, the chest. I think. Yep, that's what he was guarding. That's all. Do it. Ah, super jump. Duncan, by Jove, you're alive. Of course I am. That filter is no fuss. Oh really? <laughs> ah, we've arrived. Really? Why do I keep saying really? Take your time, I'll be just here. Glad to meet no Welshman deep in Dago country. I'm English myself. Biding my time till the next war calls me to service. Lucky King George. I'm on a piss pot like you flying his flag. Oh! Oi! Skulk! I've seen your face before. You mates with them pirates down in Nassau. Shut your fucking gob or I'll fill it with shots, you hear me? <laughs> Edward, is it? <laughs> you bastard! Hey, I warned him. Ah, uh, well that's not very nice. I'm gonna have to apologize. Now nah, my nose is hurting. You wanna dust up? I'll give you one. Really? Uh, I guess I have to kill this person. Come on, lads. I think I know how to fight. I've seen bigger arms on a bird. Like a jackdaw. Oh, look at that, I did Valerie to I think I killed that guy. Can the guards be attacking? Nope. You're not leaving me! I'll catch you up! Oh, good. Smoke bar! Siesta! I don't like having that, I like having something that's useless, or my guns. So. Sorry about that. Did not mean that. It's not personal here, just kinda want you to die. Sweet. All right, there it is. Really? Oh, all right, guys. I think I'm gonna end it here with the pigeon right above me, and me just going like holy grail style, um, in midair, while the water's still flowing. Like the water is still flowing. Everything's like that, but just me standing still. So yeah, I think that's going to be it, so thanks for watching, and hopefully I'll see you next time in episode 2 of Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. So, thanks for watching.